Hey everybody. It is Friday and it is really windy out so I am unable to go spray my deer repellent and I don't really see any other choice but to head up the street and go fishing. So it's going to be a head cam video as you can probably tell but I wanted to take a moment to say hello and introduce the video. I don't know if you just heard that loud noise but a big branch just crashed down on my shed over there and that is exactly why we're going to go fishing up the street instead of out in the woods where I would normally go. I don't like going out in the woods on windy days like today. So I also have a microphone attachment, a brand new GoPro camera. So once we switch over to the head cam, we should get some pretty good uh, video and audio quality today. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the street fishing with Dan. All right, everybody. Normally when I go cray fishing or trying to get some sculpins or something, we would make a right out of the driveway here and head down the street. But today we are going to be making a left out of the driveway and heading up the street because today we are going to go fishing. We probably will only catch a few creek chubs, maybe a few small sunfish. I've caught some small bass up here before, but if you'll notice the little stream right there across the street, that's what we're going to be fishing in, but we're going to be doing so up at the top of the street. As I said, it's a very windy day out here today. So I've also brought my bucket because you never know what you're going to catch while we're up here. So who knows, maybe we'll wind up bringing something interesting home today. But either way, we're going to have a little bit of fun throwing a little line out and seeing if we can't catch a few creek chubs or something. So as I said, sit back, relax, and enjoy the day out fishing. First catch of the day, and it is a big fat creek chub. It's probably about the size of the ones in my tank. Pretty things. Look at the beautiful colors on that. Wow. All right, well, he's going to get back in the water the hard way, but he'll get there. And it's just another little creek chub. Another big creek chub. It's a little smaller than the first one we caught. Yet another big, beautiful creek chub. I don't know how much you can see of all those colors in there, but there's gorgeous pinks and purples. You never know, a creek chub has so much color in it.
Another little creek chub. All right, everybody, I think we got one place down the street we can try. We're gonna call it good here. Start making right back towards the house. I can see all kind of little minnows swimming around down there. The problem is there's a branch sticking right out in front of me. It's going to be a bit uh, in the way. You can see this is the foundation and some of it's broken off and down in the water down here. This is where the old bridge used to be. So presumably the road we just cut up used to be down there a little further. There we go, first cast. And of course it's another big old fat creek chub. A bit smaller but oh the creek chub there we go there's another one all right everybody I think we're gonna quit while we're ahead and call that the final fish of the day so yet another creek chub nothing to take home with us Kind of hoping we might have caught a little sunfish or something interesting, but alas, we did not. So I'm going to say thanks for watching this one. Hope you enjoyed that. I'm just about a tenth of a mile down that way, so I'm going to hit it. Once again, I'm going to say thanks for watching. Make sure you're subscribed. I'll see you real soon in the next one.